What is up everybody, Mike Eater Panzer here, and we have a replay with a kind of a small game, only 8v8. I was worried I clicked the random, or I clicked the uh, ranked battles button, but tier 9, but anyways, we got a midways on each team, I'm up against an Iowa, they have a Mimitar, we have a Moskva, and uh, we have a 9, uh, they have a Fletcher, we have a Neptune, um... Almost even matchmaking, not, you know, different different ships and all that. But yeah, definitely a smaller game and definitely something that uh, turned out to be quite, quite fun, really. Um, not our fault, says MHZ123, who is in a division. Um, only waited like one minute. Uh, there appears to be some burning stuff in the background. There's a Kudasov on our team. Um, this is even more bullshit now. Yep, the new the, the new match the thing with matchmaking is matchmaking is never gonna make anyone happy. I think I think this game is um I think the current matchmaking is pretty pretty decent. I don't mind it. Um <clears throat> but still, anyways. Stay together if you want to survive is what is said in the chat, and that is exactly what we're gonna do. Where to? Well, uh, I think we're going to see um, that, that that's definitely what it looks like. I'm in the Iowa. I'm rocking the weirdo camo um, and all of that. Someone says, I don't want to die. I don't know who's who. What? That's a Z23. Um, but yeah, this is this this is an interesting battle. I mean, I, I don't I know. You can get put into different size lobbies depending on everything, but I didn't wait hardly at all for this lobby, so it must have been one they were trying to make for a while or something. I don't know. I don't know why it's 8v8, but it's 8v8, so let's make the most out of it. I'm the only battleship, and uh, they have a bunch of cruisers and destroyers, which should be interesting. We've got some uh, torpedo bombers uh, around. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm glad in my Isla. The Isla does have pretty, you know, it has good AA. That's kind of like an American thing. And there is, there is Zumo, their battleship. We're going to, of course, take our nice little pot shots at it. Um, there's the Mimitar over there, Mr. Dominant Prey. Uh, well, definitely, you know, there's 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 a lot of people I, I want, I'm afraid of. Uh, did a little overpin on the Zumo pot shots. The Midway because, well, of course, airplanes. The Minotaur because it's a Mimitar. Mogami Chapayev fires and then destroyers because they're destroyers. And so really the Izumo is the only one I'm not, like, somewhat terrified of. And, of course, he's, you know, the, the, the battleship. So he's probably also someone I should be mildly concerned about. Um, this this Garazzo, well, it'd be nice if he died. This Chapayev, though, what's what's this Chapayev? What's Mr. Toxic Potato doing? Um, he's just kind of sitting there, I think. Um, so I'm going to make him pay for his crimes, uh, and hopefully, hopefully that, that does something good. Uh, grouping looks decent, and <laughs> I'll take that 100, uh, 12 thousand damage, 100 something thousand damage. He doesn't have that much to give, no. But that that was a good that was a good salvo. No citadels, but again, we are shooting bow on. But still, uh, very very good. Definitely impressed by that. Are those torpedo bombers going for him? I am not sure. I think maybe. Um, yes, they are. They're coming back. And well, this grouping uh, did a little bit. There we are. Oh, you know another. 7,000 or so damage and there go the torpedo bombers they they look like they missed him though um i throw up oh, okay there there was a torpedo that landed so he's almost dead um team yeah at this at this point you know i'm i'm playing this as if it were a ranked battle or whatever like just kind of like guys let, 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 let's get everything let's just make sure we, we get these these enemies you know send them send them to the locker I'm not. I'm not as concerned in this particular match with kills as much as I am making sure that we that we win, which I guess is a good thing. That's kind of you know, kind of kind of the point of the game. Our Z23, who wasn't too confident in the game, is uh, well, 
he uh, he he died, so he he might need to might need to get get some reps in the in the gym, I suppose. Watch, watch some more Panzerator, learn how to play ships good. Although I don't play destroyers really ever, um, so I guess you know I'm I'm definitely a battleship player. <laughs> but anyhow, there we go. We got. The Azuma, we got our Grozoid kind of supporting me. I'm trying to move up into C to help Cap, but I'm also cautious about these destroyers, like this Grozovoy. And, uh, well, now I got the, Mi the Mimitar shooting at me, so that is definitely not welcome. Uh, do not want, for sure. So uh, I, ki I kick up the engine, and I'm trying to move somewhere where he can't hit me, because, you know... The death by a thousand cuts from the, the Minotaur gives is just not something I'm interested in at this time. Not at all. So, yeah, like, please, please stop. <sighs> Unbelievable. I need to get me one of those. I know I always say that, and then I never play, I think I have the Emerald or whatever it is. Um, gotta get that Fletcher kill because torpedoes are definitely the biggest threat to me. Um, you know, big lugging battleship. Uh, their Zumo's not doing a whole lot. Um, but anyways, I don't know what our cruisers are doing so far back. Like, I don't know what they're doing, what they're hiding from. There's one battleship and, well, another cruiser has his attention. And I think, actually, I think the cruiser does die from the Azumo. Well, there's a sit. Show me your sits, girl. Trade minister. Racist Japanese accent. Yeah. Um, and his clan tags show. Show me your sits, show clan. Yep, definitely. Um, this guy's name is Captain Bacardi. That's pretty cool. The Fletcher. Again, one, one of the things I like about doing these videos in terms of replays instead of live is I get to look at the people's names and some, some people have funny usernames. Um, for those of you who are fans of the channel way, way back, um, I, I was, there, there's a game when I'm in my uh, Ichizuki, the tier 4 Japanese uh, destroyer, and uh, this guy had the, clay, had the username Bernie Sanders, and I tried to torpedo Bernie Sanders, and now Wall Street and the, the Japanese Navy are trying to torpedo our ship. It's all the capitalists on Wall Street. We need to redistribute all the money. Yeah, kind of a C minus Bernie Sanders impersonation there. But anyways, I tried to torpedo Bernie Sanders. I ended up torpedoing an ally. I'm trying to tell this Grazo to get out of the way. I kind of just pushed him out of the way. He kind of moves a little bit. Um, the Azumo's pretty low in health. Any one of these could kill him. But I think he's going to get away. And the Mimitar. Man. I hate those. They're so annoying. They're so, so annoying. Um, but anyhow. Just kind of shooting blind. Maybe we'll hit him. Who knows. Um, get some health. And I do get an overpin on the Mimitar. So, ha. Take that. And we spotted their carrier. Their carrier has been quite aggressive in his moves. And he's going to pay the price for it. So, um, our cruisers are right behind me. Our destroyers are kind of keeping pressure on them. Kind of hurting them. I feel like, like kind of like sheepdogs almost. Um, that's that's one way to think of it, definitely. Already 82,000 damage. But, you know, that's kind of to be expected in this high level of a game. But still, pretty good. You know. when I, I don't play high tiers all the time so so getting getting big numbers is good no matter no matter what is normal for that level um i'm launching my fighters yo f five inch of freedoms that's a lone plane like snipe him please please someone there we go that's right and uh well that midway is just kind of chilling there and there's a bomber and the fighters are going to try and save me from the bombers but i think the, the bombers are definitely going to get there um Definitely get their attack run in. There we go. At least it didn't set any fires. Um, and gone forever. There we go. Beautiful. Show me your sits, girl. That's a dead midway. That is well deserved, according to Captain J.M. Nascimento. And I say, well, th well thank you. Well, thank you, dear sir. Um, 
this this Zumo has gained a lot of his health back. My lone fighter's just having a field day with these, um, you know, uh, aimless dudes. There's the destroyer way back there, probably threatening our carrier. So yeah, team, we should we should definitely go get him. Um, at this point, I don't know what our cruisers are doing. That guy kind of like that guy kind of where the bomber squadrons like where my 8.6 is. I don't know what he's doing. I don't know what he's doing. Um, you know, you I, I guess this might be my fault. Where whenever people say stick together, I tend to think that means follow me, um, but or I'll follow you. And how, how did that not do any damage to the Azumo? Like, come on, people, really, really? Well, we're, we're gonna we're gonna duel an Azumo. Um, we have a ship advantage, so uh, so collisions are not out of the question. And he's getting more hit points, like unbelievable. The Minotaur's following him. My cruisers have abandoned me. Looks like we're gonna have to do this alone. Um, kind, kind of juked him out there. Lost the front turret, which is awful. Um, I don't know if he must watch my videos and know the whole aim for the turret thing. Mimitar is hiding in smoke like the pussy he is. So annoying when, when Minotaurs do that. Like, really? And so you know what? This Izumo's looking like he wants to ram. At this point, I don't think it's the worst idea in the world ever. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and kill him before the ram, but that's just not going to happen. And the Minotaur is just a pain in the ass. There we go. We take some more shots. Jam turret. And does that count as a ram for me or a ram for him? That definitely counts as a ramp for him. But screw this Minotaur. I mean, we only have, you know, there are two ships left. This should be a lot easier than our team's going to make it. But, like, it's not this Moskva. Who's the other cruiser? The, the Kutuzov. Like, I don't know, man. Support your battleships. I really would have appreciated some support there. Like, maybe, you know, push up more aggressively and flush out the Minotaur or... You know, maybe we keep the Izumo from constantly repairing herself and all of that. But I mean, like, come on, people. I, I could really use the help. Like, really? But, whatever. Play as a team. That's neither here nor there. Um, I wish I could coach. I wish I could coach up everybody. But it is not necessarily the case. Anyhow... This, uh, like, look at this Moskva. How has he not killed the Minotaur at this point? Like, I think he's just missing his shots. Honestly, why'd the Minotaur leave its smoke? Like, I don't, I don't get that either. Um, it shocks me how some people make it to tier 10. It, it, it really does. I guess if you just play, if you just play so much, then there you go. And look, the, 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 the Kudazov got, got, um, what's it called? The Kutuzov got the Minotaur, and the Ash Asasho got the Midway. Now, I'm a little confused right here. I am wondering, I, 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 at this point, I'm not realizing that our carrier is dead. I'm just following the airplanes. And also, replays, like, the, the, the airplanes aren't, like, jolting like this in real life. Like, this is, this is replays. But anyways, um... Yeah, I'm wondering, like, why these airplanes aren't following the uh, Asa uh, Shisho or whatever. And why is all of our team going for A when the one ship we need to kill is heading towards C? Like, team. Bruh. But, I mean, like, come on, y'all. Please be better teammates and all that. Um, see, this looked a lot cooler when I d was following it because the airplanes were actually flying, like, normally or whatever. Also, I thought that Midway had jet fighters. Maybe it's just not upgraded, or maybe it's just using the prop fighters. I don't know. Maybe the Midway's been changed. I do live on, under a rock when it comes to warships at times. Um, I'm just here to have fun, y'all. Y'all know that. But anyways, yeah, our team's kind of kind of looking for him. Um, they'll find him eventually. That, that they will. But... I guess we can go over some of my stats while we're waiting around. 45 hits. I, I, I did capture C or help to capture C. Two sh two sits, a pair of nice juicy citadels. Always love to see that. Um, that's, what, that's why we do what we do. 17 secondary hits because 5 inch of freedoms. 17 downed airplanes. 
five inch of freedoms there. Two kills, two fires from the secondaries, and a flooding from our, uh, our, our, our quote unquote, from us totally ramming the Azumo and definitely not getting rammed by the Azumo. Um, I'm still going to call this ramming speed, I think. But, anyways, yeah, our team. My team is not. I don't know. They're winning, obviously. So, I, I feel like there's a couple level of teams. There's good teams that win. There's a good team that loses. There's a bad team that wins. And then there's a bad team that loses. I think this is a bad team that that won. You know what I mean? Maybe you win the bad team. The, the, I, I guess that kind of... You know, of course those are... You know, maybe the argument's like, Oh, well, if, you know, if you're a good team, then you'll win. If you're a bad team, you'll lose. No, I've been on... T I mean, this... I don't think this team is bad. I just dislike how they kind of left me out alone. Although they might have argued I ran off on my own. But these people best not be posting Reddit that battleships just camp and don't do anything. Because guess what? I led the charge. I, I literally led the charge all, all the way into the ship. All the way into their Zuma. Like, like I don't know any people who are saying that the Zuma ran me. That is definitely not what happened. But anyways, here we go. The Moskva is going to be finishing off the Asashi, Asashiho or whatever. Um, yeah, E underscore N underscore G is uh, is not long for this world. That's what happens. Um, I think one of these guys is Radar. And, well, your, your, your smoke's not going to help, bud. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, the, the, the Moskva that, that, that I'm going to say didn't support me. Um... Finishing the job, or maybe it's the other guys. But yep, yeah, th those are our stats. A lot of XP and everything. A lot of flags and boosts and all of that good stuff kicking in. I was trying to click back to port or whatever. I got second to the Moskva that um, clearly watched my videos. He knows, or he clearly doesn't. He knows how to kill steel, but he doesn't know how to support a teammate. I'm not complaining too much. We won, um, and pretty much all of our damage was main battery. Although the secondaries and the ramming did finish a lot off. So not the best game. Um, still pretty good. 115,000 damage. Uh, two kills. Not too shabby. And especially considering my first impressions of the Iowa. Not complaining one bit. But uh, of course we won. You know what that means. That means you know why we won. We big. They can't stop us. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. Consider subscribing to the channel. Follow me on Twitter. And checking out my Patreon page. Thank you all so much for watching. Until the next one, this is Mikey Darepanzator signing out. See ya, nerds.